Dude, so it's you're, like so you're, heaven on earth. So you're, so you're first time here? First time here, and to be honest with you, the only reason why I'm here is because I love to train and because of this guy right here, man. He kind of introduced me to all the cool shit here, like all the like health clubs, gyms, and just everything here is just super healthy and it's just heaven on earth if you're into exercise, man. You get your mate, your mates should come out here, shouldn't they? Yeah, everyone, everyone should come out here. Everybody should come out here. Definitely. Good morning world, welcome back. Week four on Fitness Street. I'm about to kick off my day. It's uh, quarter past seven in the morning. Woke up about an hour ago. Had an incredible sleep, nine hours sleep. Checked out of uh, Blue Hotel, now in another place for seven days. So I'm gonna make a review video, uh, an updated review video on Blue Hotel, which should be coming out tonight or tomorrow. Uh, also check the timestamps below just to jump around with this video. I've got a feeling it's going to be a pretty big day, pretty hectic day. So if you want to kind of move around the video, use the timestamps below uh, if you want to access more relevant information uh, as opposed to watching the entire video. I uh, went to the immigration office uh, three days ago and I got an extra 30 days on my, on my passport. So I can stay in the country until the 25th of July. Very easy process, 1900 baht took in my passport with my, I think it's my TM7, which is the little piece of paper that you have given to you when you, uh, when you fill in your documentation when you enter the country. So you take that with your passport, fill in another form, and then, yeah, you do the rest at immigration. It took me literally no more than 70 minutes in and out. Very, very easy process. You get an extra 30 days. So you'll see more of my ugly face for the next 30 days. So I'm gonna bring more people into the video series so you don't have to see all of me the whole time. And then uh, what else is there? Yanui. So yesterday, uh, Sunday, is a rest day for almost everybody. So I literally hired a scooter, which cost me 200 baht. Uh, yes, it is a little bit more expensive doing it on a day by day basis. Uh, I don't always hire a scooter, but uh, 200 baht was what I paid. And uh, plus, I don't mind paying a little bit more to help the Thai people out. They've been through tough times over the last couple of years. So I jumped on a scooter and then I went down to, got away from the street and went down to the beaches. So I went to Yanui, uh, which is a nice little beach that you should definitely check out if you come to Fitness Street and you want to sort of take a day off from your training. Then definitely go to, definitely go to Yanui Beach. It's a little tiny beach. You just Google search it, uh, it's easy to get to. And, uh, and then from there go to Nayan. I went to Nayan Beach, just walked around. It was just nice to get off the street a little bit um, to kind of, yeah, to get away from the hustle and bustle of Fitness Street, I guess. And then from there, I took myself to Rock Salt and I just, it was great. I went on my own, um, just enjoying my own company, I guess. So if you ever come to Fitness Street, then definitely check out Rock Salt. I highly recommend that place. It's a nice little restaurant which is on the beach, on Yanui Beach, sorry, on Nayan Beach, uh, overlooks the entire beach, and it's incredible. It's expensive, it is expensive, but I did it as a bit of a treat to myself because of a hard week of training and making the videos, and, and that was my little reward to myself. So yeah, check out Rock Salt if you ever come here. Right there is Nova. This is the, the little Muay Thai floor, the mats, how you going, my friend? My friend? My friend? He's got his earplugs in. Okay, so this is the, the floor where we'll be doing the, the group class. And they've got like a nice little water feature at the back. They've got a sauna. They've got an ice bath. Uh, they've got a steam room, I think, right at the back there. So if you're wondering where you can get access to a, a, an ice bath or steam room or a sauna, here, Nova, right here on Fitness Street. So about to do a Muay Thai class at Nova. So that's at 8 till 10 a.m. this morning, Monday morning. I haven't done a group Muay Thai class here in uh, two years, two and a half years. Uh, so I'll give you the highlights of that class coming up from 8 o'clock this morning. Just come out here, come. Come here, 
my week four, week four in fitness street. Monday morning, sweating like crazy at Nova. Come. What's going on, boss? How's it going, man? Where are you from? LA, man. First time here? First time here, man. What are you doing here? Dude, uh, just uh, training, just uh, trying to get into a fight, man. Oh, you really? Actually, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, I was actually scheduled to compete on June 17th, but it just got canceled, so I'm just chilling now. Are you upset about that? Uh, a little bit. Just, uh, I put in a, like maybe two to three hard fucking weeks, and it's just like I'm chilling now. Like, I trained hard for like absolutely no reason, so. Oh, um, I'd be crying inside if yeah. that was me, yeah. Yeah, so I'm kind of looking, it's looking like it's probably July now. Yeah, but the only problem is that I'm here until August. So I only have like two more, oh. like maybe a month and a half. And then I'm outro, so. And then you're going to come back here? Oh, of course, man. Dude, of course, man. Dude, so it's you're, like so you're, heaven on earth. So you're, so you're first time here? First time here, and to be honest with you, the only reason why I'm here is because I love to train and because of this guy right here, man. I actually heard of this guy from a close friend like two years ago and then like he kind of introduced me to all the cool shit here like all the like health clubs, gyms and just everything here is just super healthy and it's just heaven on earth if you're into exercise, man. Seriously. That's why I'm so passionate about making these videos, man, yeah, yeah. because I like when I got here in 2017 and I saw the street for the first time, I'm like, I'm coming back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, dude, it's heaven on earth, man. Dude, trust me, so, trust okay. me. Okay, parting shot, parting shot. Biggest piece of advice for guys and girls uh -huh. that have never been here before. Uh, well, you've been here for a while now. Yeah, so yeah. What would you, you say? Yeah, I'm inching close to half a year here. Um, I, I would say the biggest advice is just to kind of ease into it, you know? Just ease into it. Like, it's super hot here. Like, I. I think I remember when I first got here, I was like, oh yeah, I'm training hard like for like a couple hours every day. Like I was planning on training like three to four times a day. It was impossible because it was so mm, hot and I mm, was just mm. like, it was just too like intense. So I, like, if, like if you are here to train hard, just ease into it yeah. because it's just too hot here. Ease into it, man, because this heat will kill you. Easy. That's a good piece of advice. Yeah. I hope you're listening back home. Uh, Thanks, mate. mate. Good to meet you. Of course, mate. Cheers. Cheers. All right, guys, just finished a morning class here at Nova on Fitness Street. It is uh, 9.30 in the morning, hour and a half class, 3.50 baht. Jack, mate, how do you feel? Fantastic. Monday morning. Everyone needs to get out here. Yeah. Look at Thailand. How long, to be. how long have you been here for so far? Uh, two days so far. I'm here for one month. One month. Wish it was three months. Yeah, well, you know what? Almost everybody extends their visa. I did mine two days ago. I extended mine by another 30 days. So, oh, really? Yeah, it's easy. You just go into the immigration office, takes an hour, take 2,000 baht and your passport and a piece of paper and bang, you're out. I'll be doing it. I'll, I'll be looking forward to seeing more of you. Are you training just here or are you moving around? I'll be in Tiger Muay Thai for the month. So anywhere, anywhere, anywhere I can get training, I'll be basically. I arrived here yesterday and I just saw two guys training here. Yeah. Just came over and I said, will one of you guys train me after hours for a yeah. couple of them? Yeah, 1,000 baht. Boom. You, may sh you should get your mate, you may should come out here, shouldn't they? Yeah, everyone, everyone should come out here. Everybody should come out here. Definitely. Mate, I'll be seeing more of you on the street then. You will, absolutely. All right, mate, good to meet you. Lovely to meet you too. All right, my friends, it is 10 to six in the evening Monday, week four of my adventures. Yeah, just gonna close off this day actually and uh, gonna have a uh, tie tie this evening on Fitness Street. Uh, you should definitely drop into Thai Thai if you ever come here. It's phenomenal. You might be sort of worried about eating Thai food in Thailand and getting sick. I eat there a lot, never been sick. I'm gonna show you on screen what I'm gonna have futuristically. So I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna have tonight, right now. So I'll probably get the Thai omelet and maybe a green curry with rice and a few other bits and pieces. But you're paying no more than like, I usually pay no more than 200 baht after a full meal there it's really really phenomenal uh definitely check it out uh, and actually if you go there go and meet my time i call her my time mum. i'll throw a photo up on the screen go and get a go and get a selfie go and get a photo with uh this is my time mum, and uh you don't have to send it to me but it's just funny um yeah she's a really sweet lady small family run business um they got through the pandemic love that place love that thai family they always look after me uh so go and check them out go and eat there and say hi to my Thai mum for me. After that, I'm gonna to go to uh, Wanasara. I'm gonna go and see another Thai lady who's gonna work on my calves. She's been a game changer for me. 300 
baht is how much I pay for the massage, but she goes deep tissue on my calves because I don't know if you know, maybe I've mentioned this, I have mentioned this, but I'm not sure if you've seen it in previous videos. I've had a double double gastroc tear, both calves, um, over, the, over the last couple of years, um, pre-pandemic actually. I tore those, tore my calf with Muay Thai. Yeah, so she's actually helped my calves get back on track again. I'm, I can now, I feel like I'm now kicking with more power with my calves now because there's not as much tension in my calves because the Thai lady at Wanasara on Fitness Street has just absolutely helped me. I've been tipping her as well. She's really helping me out. So if you wanna, if you have any pain points uh, or like any issues with uh, tension, then go there, tell them, you know, and they'll, they'll sort you out. At least I've been sorted out. I'm very, very happy. I always go back there maybe three or four times uh, every week. And that's it guys. Hope you enjoy the video. Uh, don't forget to share the Fitness Street series uh, to try and get more people out here. Uh, this is a life-changing place. It'll definitely uh, make you a better human by coming out here. No exaggeration, no BS. Just ask anyone uh, that's been out here before and they'll tell you the same thing. See you tomorrow.